victim of this latest shooting is a 2021 graduate of Sycamore High School. Rodney Harris Jr.'s father tells me his son was on the right track, had plans on becoming a welder, but then gun violence changed everything. Rodney Harris Jr., known among family and friends as a fun-loving young man, the life of any party. His nickname, Deuce. Well, number two. He was the second, you know what I mean? So he was junior, so I just called him dude. Rodney Harris Sr.'s face lights up when talking about his son. One of his proudest moments, the day Deuce graduated from Sycamore High School with a certificate in welding from Scarlet Oaks. It was a, a great moment to see my son accomplish that. Gun violence cut Deuce's future short. I came on um, Coleraine Avenue. Someone just got shot. Deuce was gunned down near the Colerain Avenue restaurant in what police have called a targeted shooting. This one, this one really hurts. Harris says he saw the shooting on the news before his son was identified and had a bad feeling. Yeah, I was sitting there watching the TV. I just had a gut feeling because when I called, he called me back. He called me back and his phone was off. And his phone was never off. A short time later, Colerain police showed up at his door. My heart really didn't sink until I seen the police pull up. As police continue to investigate the shooting, Deuce's family and friends have been leading on one another for support. Last night, they held a vigil outside the family's apartment in Sims Township. Harris says the response was overwhelming. It was good to know he, he had friends. He was loved. And Harris tells me he has no idea why his son would have been targeted. Colerain police have not elaborated. Reporting live tonight in Montgomery, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5.